When I first started playing Sifu, one of the first things that caught my attention was how hard it was to play with the game's default key bindings and actually control the character in the game. The things that you should do in a fight are completely essential in this game, so you should be able to do them fast to survive. Therefore, they should be set on keys that are easy to access, but they are set on some keys that make no sense at all. But enough whining, let's remap the key bindings in a way that would make our character easier to control starting with interact i know interact is not really that useful to the fights in this game but i've never seen a game to use q for interact i'm much more used to pressing e for this so i'm gonna set this to e now let's get to a little more important stuff such as dodging now you might get used to using shift for dodge but because dodge is a really important thing to do in a fight we can set it to something a little better and easier to access I always tend to set dodging on one of the buttons on the side of my mouse, no matter if I'm playing The Witcher, Assassin's Creed, or any other game. If the dodging system is anyway similar to this, using the side button on the mouse will work like a charm. If you don't have a button on the side of your mouse, it's okay, you can use shift and still be able to dodge pretty alright. But if you do have a thumb mouse button, do give this a try, you won't regret it once you get used to it. It's easy to access, you can press it while your other hand is on your keyboard and easily use WASD to move your character in any direction that you want and get out of danger pretty easily. Next, we got takedown. Now, I'm seriously not a fan of using X for takedown because in order to press X, you have to lift your point finger from your D button, which can cause a problem to your dodging in certain situations. What I will go for is either Alt, which can be accessed by our thumb finger, or the second thumb mouse button. If you do have a second thumb mouse button, do give it a try for this option, or if you don't, you can still use Alt. You can also add another button in addition to Alt, which I don't recommend going for. It will only slow you down if you're gonna use Alt. But if you insist upon wanting to add an additional button, I will recommend either using your left click or right click. Moving on, set pickup weapon on F. It's basically used in any modern game that we play, such as Call of Duty. It's easy to use and to remember. Throw weapon and directional throw are okay in my opinion, so we're not gonna change those, but we're gonna set full focus to either tab or a button on the side of our mouse. This one is based on how much you're actually going to use focus. If it's really important to you, I recommend going with a button on the side of your mouse. If not, then just use tab. Unfortunately, I've already used both of my buttons on the side of my mouse, so I'm gonna go with the tab button here. And don't worry about photo mode, just use something else like F5. Or if you're using a keyboard that doesn't have the F buttons, then go for a number like zero. Now you can take photos that have 0% chance to compete with these very good looking photos that I took myself. Anyways, now that we're done setting these key bindings, we have a little problem on our hand, and that is select vital points and launch focus action. Apparently, no matter what you select for these two options, the game still says that no keys are set for them, and because of this, you can't perform any sort of focus attack. The only way to fix this problem is to set the preset option back to default and then back to custom again every time you launch a mission. This will make these two options not show any kind of button in front of them, so if they show unbound in front of them for you, it means that you can't perform your focus attacks. So just set the preset to default and then back to custom again. And don't worry, this will not reset all of the key bindings that we just changed. After you do so, don't touch these two problematic options anymore. They will work when you're on the mission and you can perform your focus attacks. I do hope that they fix this as soon as possible, but for now, you can just do the thing that I showed you and you will be good to go. Take care for now.